Why on blue? Seriously. <coughs> That's the homework. So, make sure that's saved, and we save it as txt, save, already exists, yes, and we go back to services, Fish Creek Animal Hospital Services, hmm, ah, services page. Link has been added to the element already. Use the span tag to contain the name of each service is offered. Ah, okay, then we're going to do that. And that just tells you to screw around with your CSS file. Hey! That means I have to change the background color and not be outside the... Uh, range of the assignment because this is freaking terrible blue on white that that's just bad I could make it a color the professor absolutely hates and make it white on black <laughs> she hates that so the link elements there for your necessary category classes. And this they want us to use. They want us to use freaking span tags. Control F span. Do I have span on my? Yes, right there. Okay. So we're going to take out strong. Strong, 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 take you out, take you out. We're going to add span. Not with an H. And these are going to be class equal category. Now that's written once, control C, control V, control V, control V, Why you over there pointer, control V, now that this is written, control C, control V, control V, control V, and control V. Why is that break missing? Why is there such a large space here? That's a good question, too. Okay, save.
configure the page footer area, which is fairly simple. Go back to here, and then copy, and go back to services. Go AV, paste. Ta da! Go AV. You're missing, oh god, that's right. This is why the color coding thing would be nice, but I did download the program, I just haven't actually installed it yet. I got like three hours of sleep last night, so. Is that seriously all it wants me to do? Okay. Save as H Nope, TXT first. Yes. Save as HTML saved. You know, I didn't like HTML before this assignment and before these classes I still really don't like HTML. So why did you not work? says use span. So now we need to figure out why span class equal. That didn't work. It's going to be something stupid. Span class equal company name. Is it because I put spaces? <laughs> wouldn't fr that freaking frickin smart, wouldn't it? So what we're going to do is we're going to take that out. Oh. For footer? No, it's right here. I'm also missing a... a there's one... two... three... Four, one A, two A, three A, four A. I don't see one of these that I'm missing. I can take that out. This is a comment. Fart off comment. I have two opening... Ah! That. That'll solve one thing. Yeah, so that's fixed that. The spans are still jacked up. I can't take this out because it's a list. They want me to use spans there. This doesn't make a difference. Or did I name it wrong? It could be entirely possible I named it wrong in the uh, CSS document, too. If I name it wrong in the CSS document, it's just not going to do anything with it. So 
we're going to do is we're going to go back to the CSS document. Which is right there. Because if it wasn't named properly, it wouldn't be working on the main page. Use a span tag to contain the name of each service, which I did. So we're going to go back and look in the book under span tags. Unless the great wisdom of this computer. Nope, that wasn't it. I was kind of hoping the link was referring to the wrong one. Go figure! Phone call! Hello! In the never-ending tradition of my channel, in the never-ending tradition of my broadcast and YouTube videos, guess what I got in the middle of recording and broadcasting? <laughs> Just a phone call in general. I'm trying to figure out why this span element's not working in HTML. Well, the part of the assignment is actually using span, so I'm kind of stuck in this regard. What are you trying to do? A homework assignment. I'm broadcasting I it live. I, I, I know that. <laughs> I said, num, 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 num. I know that, but I do this all day long, don't I? So mm -hmm. tell me, what are you trying to do for your assignment with a span? Well, just click on the link and you can actually see. Oh, send me the link and I'll do it. Category. Do I have a category exclamation mark? Oh, that figure. No, no, that's not how it's written in the book, though. It wouldn't be the first time the book is wrong, but then it wouldn't have worked in my notes. Category exclamation mark equal category. I don't know, class exclamation part. Yeah, there's no exclamation point in my notes, and this page works. Exclamation mark is a very powerful thing. Um, you tend to use that in comments. Out. Let's have a look. So, list item, span, class, um. No, 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 no. Right, where's your class? I assume, he says, you are holding... Hang on a second, stop. Where is Starship? Oh, it's up here. Oh, you know, no, I can't do that. I can't do this because it can hear my bloody voice feeding back at me. <laughs> ah, about five seconds later. Ah, panic. Um, okay, I'll reset this so you can't hear it. Then everybody else can be confused, I guess. There. Yeah. The CSS document is an external CSS file, Fish Creek CSS. Because that's exactly, it's written there exactly as it's written in my notes. It works here. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I'm going to make it so everybody can hear you again. There we go. So yeah, it's written here in my notes. Exactly as it's written here. Because I kind of copied and pasted okay. it. That, that should, you should have company name. Yeah. Oh no 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 no, because in here this CSS is a different. This is my notes. This is referring to an entirely different cascading oh, okay, style sheet. All right, let's have a look at this other style. You have correctly used span there correctly. Your class is called category. Oh, I know what I did. I spelled category wrong. It's here with an.